you know you've been lied to about breakfast being the most important meal of the day? It was all just a huge marketing ploy. The saying was created by Dr. John Harvey Kellogg. Wait a minute, you mean to tell me that Kellogg, as in Kellogg's cereal, ingrained this concept into our culture in efforts to sell more breakfast cereal? The phrase was published in a 1917 magazine and has made its impact on consumers so much so that the food giant made billions off its cereals. Then years later, in the 1920s, the meat industry wanted to sell more meat, so they hired Edward Bernays, who is dubbed the father of propaganda. Oddly enough, Bernays was the nephew of Sigmund Freud. You know, just one of the biggest names in psychology. Yeah, no big deal. Oh God, I don't like where this is going. Well, anyways, Bernays pioneered the use of psychology in a wide variety of marketing efforts. But when it came to boosting demand for meat, Bernays saw opportunity at the breakfast table. So he went and convinced people and doctors that breakfast was the most essential diet with studies and experiments which turned out to be all paid propaganda. So Bernays turned breakfast into a massive success. He analyzed the world's greatest business and marketing strategies every day.